I'm very excited for today's video because the company Diamond Dust sent me over a preview for their up and coming subscription box. Now I haven't peeked inside, okay? So you're getting my first initial reaction and we're gonna see what this box is working with. First of all, it is massive. Look at how huge this box is. My head is already big, so you know this box is huge. If you stay on top of my community post, as soon as this box goes live, I will let y'all know. This box is going to be a quarterly box, so it will come with the seasons. So you'll get like a summer box, a winter box, a spring box, okay, a fall box. It's gonna kind of match up with the different seasons to give you a little bit of something, something, something to look forward to. I'm gonna cut that part out. That just sounded really ugly. Maybe I won't cut it out and I'll just leave it in there as like a blooper. What's very exciting about this box is that it comes with a purse. Now, Everyone's purse is gonna be different. Not everyone's gonna get the same purse. You get to stunt on the gram with your unique purse and it's gonna also include some other items, but we'll get into that in just a little bit. Now, I do wanna say this video is being sponsored by Diamond Dust as well as Cabo Buttercream. I will have a link in the description box so that if you wanna check these companies out, you can go ahead and peruse what they have on sale. Now, Diamond Dust is a website where you can find new and thrifted items. There you can find jewelry, okay, crafts. You can find clothing for men, women, and children, as well as some handbags and different neat little gifts. If you're in the Atlanta area, there will be a pop-up event held by Diamond Dust. And this is going to be on April 21st between 12.30 and 6 p.m. And the location is 590 Ponce de Leon Avenue, Northeast. I think I'm saying that right. I'll have all the information listed in the description box because you know, your girl's pronunciation is trash, okay? I can't pronounce a damn thing. But y'all, I'm excited. Let's go ahead and get into this box. I've been wanting to open this for like the longest. Ooh, <laughs> I need to show y'all. I need to show y'all what this is looking like when I open her up. Get into it. First of all, the presentation is absolutely stunning. Very girly, which y'all know I love girly things, okay? I'm a girl's girl. Oh! First of all, this is so cute. Oh my God. It says diamond dust, very beautiful. And it's nice and sealed with a very pretty Cabo butter. I think this is so pretty. Ooh, okay. So first and foremost, I received a Diamond Dust Consignment Gift Certificate and it is worth $5 and it's valid until May 30th. So I, I gotta get shopping. <laughs> I'm gonna use my gift certificate, okay? So this is just like a thank you note. It just, you know, lets you know the different companies and the website and also asks for feedback, which I will definitely be giving. Isn't this so pretty, bruh? Oh. This is a girl's girl box, okay? You're girly and you like not nice things, this box is gonna be for you. And like I said, once this box goes live, I will post all the information so you guys can get in on the action. There's just so many goodies in here, I don't even know where to start. Okay, this is so cute. This was personalized for your girl. I love this. When I get my new filming studio, this is gonna be in the background. Very beautiful, very girly. Y'all know I love pink. It's very pretty covered with a pink. You have these different little details right here. And this is like a handmade product. Very, very pretty. That's her new home. The next item that I'm pulling out is, ooh. Now I've used this stuff before. It is absolutely amazing. And this is the Cabo Buttercream. And this is what it looks like in its packaging. Nice and sealed up so that if any accidents happen, it's not gonna disrupt the rest of the box, okay? You're not gonna have to worry. If this doesn't come intact, the rest of your box will be intact because it's nice and sealed up. The only thing that I will say, I want some bubble wrap, okay? I want some bubble wrap because I don't want it to come broken. I need some bubble wrap over her just to keep her nice and safe. I've used this buttercream before. It's that girl. When Bella was first born, I, I don't know if you guys know, but like when you have a baby, when they first come out, their skin looks so smooth. But then after a few weeks, their skin starts to get these like little bumps kind of all over because I mean, they're new to the world. So their skin has to get adjusted and all of that stuff that they were soaked in, the amniotic fluid, all of that needs to come out. And so what you'll see is 
babies will have like a, a thin layer of like little bumps all over their face. What you can do, you got this stuff right here, is after you wash your baby's face, put just a little bit on your hands and just kind of massage it through and then put that over their skin. Bella's skin looked so good after using this butter. I'm not even lying. I will insert pictures so you guys can see what I'm talking about. This buttercream is amazing. And if you have like any like skin issues, like any psoriasis on your hands or, you know, well, you could get psoriasis anywhere. Psoriasis, eczema, things like that. This stuff works beautifully, beautifully on it. I love a cute little jar. I'm gonna keep it a buck with y'all. I like that it's not branded on the outside. The reason being is after I'm done using this, I wanna use this for other things, right? Like you could put a cute little tea candle in there. This is what it looks like. And all this stuff is homemade and organic. Organic. And it smells so good. This is what she looks like when you open her up. Nice and full. Okay, we're not skipping out on a product because you can see the product all over the lid. The stuff is really thick because it's a butter. As you're rubbing this into your hands, it is going to melt into absolute amazingness. You just rub this in. You see how easily that just like melted into my skin? And like I said, it smells so good. If you smelled cocoa butter and shea butter before, it smells so freaking good. And it just left my skin feeling so nice. Ah, I love that stuff. I'm so glad to re-up. I put this stuff on baby Bella's face and I put it on her hair. So this is some good stuff. It's baby approved, all right? It's baby approved, but you can use it for yourself too. You know, you know baby, take a little bit from the baby girl and put it on yourself. Very happy to have it in this box. The next item that I'm pulling out, oh, it's a cute little notebook. And it says, you deserve your dream. Now, this is what the notebook is looking like. It's been customized. As you can see, it has similar details as the as the letter S. So this is nice and customized, very cute. Oh, and I like this little band right here so you can keep it nice and closed. I needed one of these. <laughs> I needed one of these. I don't know if y'all are like me. I love a good to-do list. And whenever I'm writing my to-do list on like regular notebook paper, I always draw the little box so I could check it off myself. But this is a nice notebook that already has the little boxes there. So you can just write down all the things you need to do for the day, all the things you need to buy, grocery list, all those things. And you can just check it off right there. So, ooh, this is so nice. And it's gold and it's pink, pink and gold. Like, can you get a better color combo? No, no, you can't. Oh, we gonna get some use out of this. This is nice. Very useful for us list girlies out there. Next, I got a cute little pen. And y'all, it's so girly. Y'all already know, I love cute little like cat ear type of things. And it has little like glitter things on the inside. Very cute. I thought the pen part was gonna come out of the bottom, but no, it comes out of the top like this. Let me see what this writes like. Use my little notebook, right? A little something, something. I feel like, uh, <laughs> what's his name? Blue's Clues. I feel like Blue's Clues. You know, when he got his little notebook and he started to write the drama clues. That's what I feel like. All right, let's see. I hope I spelled that right. It'll be so bad if I didn't spell this right. I grew up on on um the, the, the little thing, spell check. I grew up on spell check. So if I spelled this wrong, please don't roast me in the comments. But yeah, it wrote really, really smoothly. I was kind of hoping it was going to be this pinky, pinky kind of color, but I feel like black ink is just a little bit more useful, right? It's a little bit more useful. So that is really nice. This pen wrote beautifully. It was very smooth, very easy to write with. Uh, hopefully I spelt that right. I don't know. Ooh, okay, this is cute. This is very cute. Oh my God, there's more stuff in here. I was not expecting this bag to come with this many items. Like I'm shook it. Now the next item that I'm seeing in here is a cute little coin purse. And look, it matches my little pen. You have the customization right here. Very beautiful, very pretty little glitters. Okay, goes with the diamond dust theme. And you can just put like your ID and put some, you know, coin, keep your coins in here, right? Like if you're just going somewhere really quick, you can just kind of put, you know, like your ID, a credit card or some like change and a few dollar bills in here and you're good to go. Very cute. And I love this hardware right here. Let's see how she zips. Oh yeah, that's a sturdy zipper. Okay, that's a sturdy zipper. And the glitters aren't really coming off as much as I thought they would. Usually with the glitters, it comes off very easily, but I've been rubbing it and the glitters aren't falling off, which is really good. So yeah, this is really cute. And now if you don't really like 
this little powder puff part, you can just like kind of unclip it. You can just unclip it and, you know, hang it on something else. Your book bag, your uh, other bag. I don't know. You can just hook it somewhere else if you don't like it. I'm guessing you can just like kind of hook to your purse so that you can have it like on the outside if you wanted it. So like this will be a nice little detail you can have on the outside of your purse. Very excited to use this. So freaking adorable. I want to save the handbag for last. The next item that is in here is a umbrella. A umbrella and umbrella. I'm acting like English isn't my first language. It's Rain Essentials by Shed Rain. This is a manual open umbrella. Very nice. It comes with this little cover. Ooh, it says stuff. Okay, it says stuff on here. Hold up. I don't want to open it all the way because you know that's bad luck. You're not supposed to open an umbrella on the inside of the house. Oh, that's so cute. It's very Georgia. It's like, it says the Georgia lottery on here. So you have the peach and then the really pretty silver. Today could be the day. I might have to play them numbers after getting this. I might have to play them numbers. It's always good to get things that are functional. Things that you will actually use. I can actually say actually in that sentence because actually sits. It's nice to get things that you can use, not just things that are so random where you're not going to get use out of them. It's just going to be like, oh, this is cool that I received it. But then it's just sitting in the corner of your hoarded house for decades to come. This product will get used. So whenever it's raining, I could bust out my today's the day umbrella. The glitter on there is cute. The rest of the umbrella is kind of basic, which I mean, I don't really need a super exaggerated, exciting umbrella. The final product, get into this purse. Okay, I'm gonna need you to get into this purse. It is so freaking cute. First of all, the color is absolutely beautiful. It's like this kind of mustardy yellow type of situation going on. And then you have the gold detail, very beautiful. The handles sit upright, very nice. The back of the bag is very simple, which is beautiful to have because the front is very busy. So the back can be a little bit more muted, a little bit more, you know, party in the front, business in the back. Absolutely adorable, has a little keyhole. Now let's see what's going on in the bag. For the bag itself, it comes with a longer strap just in case you didn't want to hold it like a handheld like this. So it comes with a nice strap. Everything looks really nice, really nice. So when you're looking on the inside, it comes with this pocket right here, which has a zipper. On the inside, you can store like items that you don't want just swishing around in your purse. You can store that right in here, which I think is so nifty. I don't remember purses having things like that. Or maybe I'm just out the purse game for so long that I just, I don't know what the new new is. I'm about to switch my stuff out today. When you look on the inside, it has a really nice cloth material. And then you have details of that same mustard orange on the inside. And you got some extra pockets. And there's another zipper component right on this side in here. This purse is actually a decent size. You can put so many things in here. And I like that this part kind of separates it. So you can put like your wallet and things on one side and then other things that are just like like smaller items you can put on the other side so that you're not constantly bumping into your little smaller items when you're trying to get your wallet out. You can kind of organize your purse so that it's easier to access. Easier to access. Why did I say it like that? I act like English is not my first language. Like, let's be serial. This is by the brand Alyssa and they're located, ooh, Los Angeles, New York, and Milan. Ooh, Milan. So this is what the little, little cart thing looks like. So this product is vegan and it's lead free, which is very nice to know. You know, no animals were harmed in the making of this beautiful, beautiful bag. But y'all, that was everything in my Diamond Dust subscription box. Like I said, this box has yet to go live. So this is a little preview of what you could get when you start your subscription. Once the subscription goes live, I will let you guys know in a community post. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Fae Bay. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces.